Hey everybody, Shelby here, back for another video, and today, we are going to be doing some more unboxing. Well, not really unboxing, but we're going to be checking out this mouse and this keyboard. You see this, this mouse right here and this keyboard? These are actually really cool because they have macros on them. And if you don't know what macros are, you will know in a second. Here's the mouse. It's pretty cool. It has some lights and stuff on it. But the main part of it is to not just look cool. It's to have some macro keys on it, so you can like press them, and then they will do a circ they will do like a code or something, or a shortcut. It can be like a shortcut for something. So you go here onto this uh, macro mouse thing. If you don't know what button settings are yet, you will you will know later. We have this, this the most important thing, and then we have this, this, and all that. So. Here are all of my macros I have right now. You can like click new, name it something. Well, let's just use this one for example. If you like put down a command and then not record a delay, it will like do it rapidly like if you're holding it down. But um, let me just show you this. Um, hmm. So if you go here and then you wanna select a macro that you made, you can um, just click it. And then you can do these. You have three options. This is just the normal. Once you press it, then yeah, it just does it once. But if you click this, repeat until you press any key to end. So once you press it, you have to press another key on the mouse for it to stop doing that. And that's really good for the auto click and the auto hold and auto walk and some other stuff like auto shift. There's also repeat until the key release. So if you hold it down, like hold down this, for example, it will um, just repeat the command until um, you're done. So yeah, that's pretty cool. But yeah, back to making macros. So you can make your own macro, you can press new, you can make it and then you can start record and then like if you want to type something out like youtube and then stop record if you want a delay just in case there's a delay between like opening things then you can like click that and then we'll record delays so like it will have those delays right there and then that's how many milliseconds it will wait let me just show you something. Um, you see this? This up arrow and this down arrow? That means like it's going down and then it's going up with this up arrow. So go like. So it'll go like. Like really fast. If you don't record a delay, it will like almost do it at the same time. But it's like just really fast to the point it just looks like it's doing it at the same time. So you can apply, you can go to button settings, you can click that and then yada 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 yada. You can do that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I can show you um, the keyboard after I show you something else. Okay, so you're in a game of Doom Spire and you get really annoyed on how long it takes for you to die so you can just set a macro for a reset key and then you won't have to wait as long to die uh, because you know you can just reset and it will um decrease the time the amount of time it will take to um die is like this that's really annoying so you can just reset and then we'll waste less of your time yeah that's pretty much all you can do it's also this auto clicker i can show you right here you can also use it for this and all that stuff 
Next is the keyboard. The keyboard can be used for a bunch of things, but the um, this macro keyboard right here can be pretty annoying with its macros because it has a delay, like no matter what. These are the macros. There's, these can hold a lot of macros and that's pretty much the point. So there's section one, section two, and section three. All these can be um, different macros. For this one, I'll show you on the gameplay. It can do this. It can do this. It can type things out for you like this. But it has the delay, so the mouse would be really better. Also, I look like I'm trash at Doomspire right now. This isn't a good example to get out of there. Um, yeah. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much the um, keyboard and the mouse done. Oh, also, I almost forgot how to record the macros on the keyboard. So, you're going to want to click this thing right here. You want to select a macro, like, you know, six instead of se um, section three. And then you can, like, press keys, like, lol, I'm recording, lol, enter. And then you can press this to stop. And then, let me show you what it will do. Hands off. See? I can type things out for you. Here to lie. F3 F3 F300 F300 Gaming series Create for game So I'll show you the mouse Press the mouse Macros here, macros there Macros everywhere And then the keyboard Pretty cool. Oh, and also it lights up. You can press this if it will work. Well, it's working. It just barely turns on. But yeah, if you can see that tiny piece of red going on on the letters, then yeah, some light. So yeah, cool. Set. Make sure to slap that like button and punch that subscribe button. Um.